in South Africa. The best of African contemporary art is being showcased at this year's Investor Cape Town Art Fair. The event takes place amidst unprecedented levels of international interest in art originating from the continent. The art fair also creates an opportunity for many emerging African artists to showcase their works to galleries from around the world. Here's CGTN's Travis Andrews with more. For many years now, the Invest at Cape Town Art Fair has become renowned as Africa's leading destination to buy local and international art. It showcases some of the finest examples of African contemporary art and in all its forms, with the vibrancy and diversity that transcends the canvas. It is this unique selling point that allows you to attract some of the most in-demand artists from the African continent, many of whom are on display once again. We've got um, artists coming from all over the African continent as well as internationally. Um, there are over, I'd probably say, 100, 200 artists showing at the fair. Um, we have people coming from West Africa, from, um, from Europe, from North America, Australia, and the Middle East. Um, and we, we have a large representation from all over the globe. Cape Town's art scene is constantly evolving, and that is quite evident at the fair. The Zeitz Mocha Museum in the Mother City has also provided a home to some of these splendid works of art. But many local artists display here because the country's art scene still needs transformation and become representative of the diversity of voices that have actually created art in the country. The historical event that uh, suggests that an artist's work, mostly from the township, they are not shown into bigger spaces. So for me, I break through uh, that cycle to say, no, my work must be also shown in the international platform, international spaces, and, and become part of the dialogue of art and artists together. There are also different expressions of contemporary art that are the fair's attention grabbers including powerful works with social and political narratives. Now this event also provides an ideal platform for international buyers who are intent on finding the next masterpiece from the African continent. And many of them are looking at East Africa, with particular focus on Kenyan artists' rich and multi-layered works. African art is booming everywhere. And I can see from the work that I'm producing, like how people are responding to work, how much they're purchasing the work. So, and for other artists, you can see that. And globally, big galleries are taking in African artists more and more and more and more. And it is, it is such a great thing. Yeah. There's also a commercial aspect to the fair, and it's important for work to be bought and sold to various galleries around the world, so that the appreciation for African art can continue to grow for many years to come. Dr. Andrews, CGTN, Cape Town.